everyone and welcome back to my channel. I know that it's been a while and I wanted to say before anything thank you so much to everyone who has subscribed recently. I don't think I really deserved it but I'm here now and I'm gonna try to make up for it and I'm gonna do a round two of what I eat in a day. My first what I eat in a day video, I'll link it in the corner right now, is undoubtedly the most popular video on my channel to date so of course I want to do more of what you guys want to see and some of you have requested a part two so that's what we're gonna well, that's what we're gonna do today uh, it's currently 8 45 and I have just had some coffee and water some of you already know that that's how I always start my day I don't really like to eat uh, breakfast in the morning I don't say that I intermittent fast because I've been doing this since way before even I knew what intermittent fasting was and before it like became a thing, which it is now. But I'm gonna run a few errands and then I'm gonna come home to break my fast and then after that I'm going to take you guys along to the gym for a leg slash booty session. So that's the plan for today. I haven't made any plans as of what I'm going to eat yet and I don't think I have too much in my fridge to be honest. So this is just gonna be completely like really random and really honest how I actually eat on a day-to-day -day basis so I really hope you guys will enjoy it thank you again so much to everyone who has subscribed thank you for being here with me and if you like this kind of video please give me a thumbs up and I will make sure to do more of them and yeah so I will see you in a little bit okay so I'm back home it's almost 12 o'clock and I have breakfast ready I have two fried eggs that are fried in olive oil with chives salt and pepper I have some steamed broccoli and I have two of these rice cakes that are actually made with lentils I'm not a huge fan of rice cakes but I really like these they have a tomato and paprika flavor and have one of them with hummus and cherry tomatoes and then the other one is guacamole and cottage cheese and some cherry tomatoes and then I always take my vitamin B with breakfast because it gives me energy I have a big glass of water and I have audience hi time to dig in and then I will see you at the gym guys roll it
gym now, I'm sure you could tell that I had a pretty intense workout. All of the exercises that I did today are exercises that I know and love and really feel like I can connect with my muscles when I perform. So those are some of my favorites, what you just saw. I have not taken a shower yet. I'm going to make a smoothie first because I want to get my nutrition in before I shower. I'm actually starving. So I'm gonna make one of my famous smoothies and they are actually more like a shake anyway. Uh, it's a protein shake, but blended with some fruit, usually berries, uh, spinach, milk, mm, oats, because I want some complex carbohydrates as well, not just fructose. And a few more things. I'm gonna show you everything, of course, and then I'll show you the result. <music> Chocolate and blueberry is currently my favorite flavor combination. And by the way, the protein powder I just showed you, it's not my favorite flavor, so I don't recommend you buy it. I've been on a smoothie kick for the last, I would say, three months. And I think that they're just such a great way to get a lot of good nutrition in, in a really enjoyable way, at least for me. Today, it's kind of my lunch. I would say I need to have dinner and then I'll probably have a snack after. Uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So yeah, that's my tip. If you're struggling to get good nutrition in, make a smoothie. And I also have chia seeds in here, which help with hydration and also with uptake of micronutrients. Some people don't like to blend the chia seeds. I prefer to do it because I like the consistency that it makes. It becomes more thick and that's what I like. So I'm gonna enjoy this now and then I'm gonna take a shower and then probably the next time I'll see you, it'll be for dinner. So this is what I'm gonna do. I have a fillet of salmon, which I will fry with my Argentinian barbecue. This is a smoky paprika flavor barbecue uh, seasoning and I really enjoy it on salmon. And then I had some frozen sweet potato fries. These aren't the best, cleanest, healthiest option. Uh, but I think that they're okay and I like to have them in the freezer for whenever I need them. Right now I had to choose between this or rice and I'm not a huge fan of rice so I'll easily take these and I will fry them in the pan and they're actually very delicious if you fry them with the cinnamon. Did I already say that? <laughs> uh, I fry them with the cinnamon and they become very crispy and delicious. So I do recommend these, they're from Mercadona actually. And then I have some kale which I will fry in olive oil with salt and I will add the rest of my steamed broccoli that I made for breakfast. So that's gonna be my easy and very quick dinner today. So that's dinner ready. I don't know that it looks too appetizing. <laughs> like I said, I've got uh, kale and broccoli. Fun fact about me, by the way, those two are my favorite vegetables in the entire world. I love it and it makes it really easy for me to eat healthy because I actually crave them. Sweet potato and salmon. And because it's Friday, I have a cheeky glass of red wine, which is Villa Antinori, if you're curious. And of course, I drink it with a straw because nobody wants stained teeth. <laughs> and I have a huge glass of sparkling water. Oh, and I also actually have a little cocktail, which I take with my dinner. This is turmeric, calcium and magnesium. These two are glucosamine and chondritin. I'm not sure how to say that word. And macaroot extract and 5-HTP. I actually supposed to take two of this, but there's only one inside. I don't know why. So that's my little cocktail. Oh, and final thing, because it is allergy season. <laughs> this only takes the edge off for me, but it's still worth taking it. And I take it in the evening because I hate waking up in the morning 
and feeling horrible. Like I wake up way too early and I feel already horrible. So I take it in the evening. That's my exciting Friday night. You haven't been in the vlog much today, have you? No? Oh, you want salmon and sweet potato. Okay. A little sweet potato. She usually gets a little one. Enjoy. Mm -hmm. So it's now 9.30 and I want something sweet, a little snack. So I'm going to do a Greek yogurt with raspberries. And I think these are called blackberries, but I'm not sure. <laughs> English is not my first language. And then I have this natural fruit and nut mix, which has almonds, cashews, mulberries, goji berries, raisins, and cranberries. Oh my God, my language is horrible, you guys. <laughs> and then I'm going to do some chia seeds and dried coconut flakes. Oh, and I almost forgot to show you these. You know how much I like pineapple. This is dried pineapple and they're quite chewy and delicious. So I'm gonna have a few pieces of that. <laughs> Okay guys, it is the end of the day and the end of this video. I'm just about to take my makeup off and then I'll go to bed to read a little bit. Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you for spending the day with me. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave me a like because it really does actually help my channel. And if you would like to subscribe, I would love to have you back and I'll see you again very soon in my next video. Bye.